Hello YouTube and welcome to a brand new Unity 3D Space tutorial. So last tutorial we added, I honestly can't remember, but we did something, atmosphere messages, that's it. There's our messages. So what we're going to do in this tutorial is we need something that if, what, every single game we've done and we haven't done in land yet, a pause button. So we press escape or we can click on screen and it will pause the entire game. We're only going to do the, um, well, we're going to do both actually, but yes. So, we're going to find our character and GUI scripts, and we need a new script. So, we'll go to our scripts and uh, we'll go to HUDs, space, and in here we'll right click create JavaScript, and we'll call this um, ship um, on screen actions. Yes, that'll do. And we'll assign this to GUI scripts. And in here, once it's done, we're going to put stuff like pause, so we can have an on-screen pause button, a cargo if you want to click like inventory, stuff like that. So we sign that to that, and we'll open this up. So the first thing we need is something to store our pause texture. So we're going to type var pause background texture background. There we go. This will be a texture 2D. So that's that one and we don't need function start but we will need function update and we need to duplicate this and make function on GUI so on GUI whichever way you want to say it so in function update we need something that says pause is now active so we need another boolean saying var pause active equal well be a boolean equals false so make it private so we can't see either so you press um, whatever button you want, so I want escape, so we'll use escape. And then it'll activate pause, otherwise it won't. So in here we're going to type if pause active equals true, then I want it to create a new box, so gui.box. This will be a rect, and we'll say screen, well, zero, zero, screen dot width and screen dot height. That will set it to fill our entire screen no matter size what your monitor is. And then we'll put a comma and put our background in. Perfect. So now that'll load it on. But then we need a way to actually activate it now. So we're going to type if input.get key up. And we'll type escape, which is your ESC key, which is at the top left side of your keyboard which is most defaultly risen with pause. I know a few online flash games use P, but most games usually just use escape. So escape, and then we'll just set pause, active equals true. Simple as that. So we've got that, but we now need somewhere to store the button for the actual pause on screen button. So again, we'll duplicate this and we'll type in pause, button texture, and we'll duplicate this entire line, but put, else if pause active equals false because if the big pause screen's filling your screen then you don't want to be seeing all the hoods on the background you want it all to be gone so you just see the pause screen but if not you can ignore this bit but i want to do that so this is where i'm going to put all of our on-screen GUIs. so we're going to start with if gui button um we don't want it to be this size no more oh dear postpone just for now Sorry about that, but we'll change this to say x axis will say 500, this is a 0 down 64, 64, I don't know, that might work. And we'll set it to pause button texture. And what happens when we click this button? We will enable the pause. However, currently with the way we've done it, we've got no way to turn pause off. So here, we need to type if pause active equals true then we set it to false equals false else so if it's active then make it true otherwise I remember that a user showed me a way you can do that within one if statement and I, I can't remember how I did it I think it was something like an exclamation mark somewhere but it was a good trick but I really can't remember that I'm sorry about that but let's try it then so really really quick we're just assigning our things and hopefully it should work a pause screen we can eventually 
implement this to our land game because we need to so pause background so in my textures folder you'll see that I have added atmosphere not atmosphere pause so we have a big pause screen which is will fill the entire screen and a pause button which we can click on to pause so and um, pause screen would be that one and pause button would be that one so let's see if it works so load the up we should immediately see a pause button perfect we click it paused perfect click off it paused perfect so as you can see it hides the majority of our hoods we still need to work on it however we can still move while it's paused which is not very good so what we're going to do is i know it's not filling the screen yet but that's something to do with the stretching of it change it to gui maybe it'll stretch i'm not sure and yes we'll try that but we need to make it so if pause is active the whole game freezes now how do we do that i know you all know it we did it last tutorial actually so we're going to type here if pause active equals false then time dot time scale equals 1.0 which means it's running but if pause is active then time dot time scale equals zero so we pause the game we play the game pause play pause play simple as that let's see if it stretches pause we can still move and we can still but we can't fire and we can still move we need to disable the scripts but the whole entity of the game will freeze and everything will freeze so as you can see it's not moving because it's frozen play it boom oh that was cool let's build it up build it up build it up and boom oh that is cool we definitely need to get rid of that though but yeah as you can see it pauses it's now full screen pause it you can't click off it when, we vent, when I find out how to do it for um, components, I'll have to look up, I can't remember off the top of my head. We'll make it disable all the components on the character, so um, all these scripts will be disabled, and then you won't be able to do anything, but then in terms of play, you will be able to do everything. So thank you for watching a short, sweet tutorial just about pausing. There's the script again, I'm sorry I forgot to zoom in. Really, really simple script, um, it'll be in the description or right here if you want it. Just scroll down. So thank you for watching. I really hope you liked it. Join my Facebook group. Any issues, comment below and see you next time.